Hello and welcome back. We now discuss a few examples from exponents. The question is write as a single power of 2. Let's take the first example. 2 into 2 raised to a. Now this actually this 2 is nothing but 2 raised to 1 right. The power is 1 into 2 raised to a. So, we could combine this as 2 raised to 1 plus a, right? a raised to m into a raised to n is a raised to m plus n. So, we have applied that law over here. Let's see the next one. 4 into 2 raised to b. Now, 4 could be expressed as 2 square into 2 raised to b and now we could combine the 2 as 2 raised to 2 plus b. Moving to the next example, 8 times 2 raised to t. Now 8 could be expressed as 2 cube into 2 raised to t. And now we could combine the two as 2 raised to 3 plus t. Moving to the next example, 2 raised to x plus 1 the whole square. So this is in fact 2 raised to, now here these two terms get multiplied, so it is 2 raised to 2 times x plus 1. Now we could open the brackets in the power over here, so we have 2 raised to 2x plus 2. Taking the next example, the next example is 2 raised to 1 minus n raised to minus 1. Now here again we could multiply these two terms. So you have 2 raised to minus 1 into 1 minus n. Let us open up the brackets here. So minus 1 into 1, that's minus 1. Minus 1 into minus n is positive n. So this could be written as 2 raised to n minus 1. Let's take the next example, 2 raised to c upon 4. Now this we could express as 2 raised to c and 4 could be expressed as 2 square. Now we could use the law of exponents. So we have 2 raised to c minus 2. a raised to m upon a raised to n is a raised to m minus n right taking the next example 2 raised to m on 2 raised to minus m so again we use the law of exponents so this is 2 raised to m minus minus m so we have 2 raised to m plus m so finally this becomes 2 raised to 2m Let's take another example, 4 upon 2 raised to 1 minus n. Now, 4 could be expressed as 2 square and in the denominator we have 2 raised to 1 minus n. So These powers would get subtracted, so we have 2 raised to 2 minus 1 minus n. Let us open the bracket here. So, we have 2 raised to 2 minus 1 and this becomes plus n. So, finally, we have 2 raised to no, 2 minus 1, that's 1 plus n. Let's take one more example. 2 raised to x plus 1 upon 2 raised to x. So, here again, we could combine the two using the law of exponents. So, this is 2 raised to x plus 1 minus x. 
so x cancels with minus x so we have 2 raised to 1 which is simply equal to 2 let's take one last example 4 raised to x upon 2 raised to x minus 1 now in this case 4 could be expressed as 2 square raised to x and in the denominator we have 2 raised to x minus 1. Now 2 times x over here becomes 2 raised to 2x divided by 2 raised to x minus 1. Now, using the law of exponents we have 2 raised to 2x minus x minus 1. Now this if we simplify we will have 2 raised to 2x minus x plus 1. So we get the final answer as 2 raised to now 2x minus x is x plus 1. So the answer is 2 raised to x plus 1. Thank you for watching the video.